A waste pro truck that caught flames in South Bradenton Monday has people asking why and how it happened. SNN's Ben Bulbeck talked to a waste pro manager and witness. He filed this report. Cleanup continued on 54th Avenue Drive West in South Bradenton following a waste pro truck catching flames Monday afternoon. Nothing in my 21 years that I have seen anything like that. Fortunately, no one was injured or harmed, but there's questions to whether what occurred in the aftermath was for the best. The little top of the truck was on fire, and soon as I saw that, they opened the back, and all the trash like just flowed out, and then it just got worse. So much worse, this happened. That car is affecting to blow up! That car is about to blow up right there. Yes, I think it exploded, but the aftermath of what it looked like, it looked really bad. But according to Waste Pro, the driver did the best thing he could have done in that situation in releasing the burning load. We asked them to, to bring the truck somewhere safe and eject the load and get that load as far away from any people or property as possible. Unfortunately for this driver, he had no choice. He was at the end of a dead end street. Though a car was destroyed and a few others damaged, most importantly, no one lost their life. There's no clue what caused the fire, but Waste Pro has a pretty good idea. The fire started in the body, in the body of the truck, and it could have been from material at any point of the route from any residents, from anybody who wasn't paying attention to what they were putting in their container. Bottom line is even though it's trash or recyclables, they could still cause a lot of damage if you don't pay attention. We need to be more, more aware of, of the possible effects of what we put in our trash because this is a prime example. Reporting in Manatee County, Ben Bobick, SNN, the Suncoast News Network. It's unknown who will be paying for the car's damage, but we know Waste Pro rented a car for the family and had the damaged cars towed to a nearby stop.